Ladies and gentlemen, on May the 7th, you have a very important decision to take. And when you take that decision, I hope you will remember that five years ago, when the Conservatives came to power with the Lib Dems, Britain was on the brink. Britain was in crisis. Over the past five years, we've had to take some very tough and very difficult decisions, but necessary decisions, so that we can pull up Britain back on its feet, up from its knees. We have got the economy on the road to recovery. The deficit as a share of our income has been halved, and the debt as a share of our income is falling. Two million new jobs. 25 million people have had a tax cut, and three million people have been taken out of taxes altogether. You have had strong leadership from David Cameron, notwithstanding the constraints of the coalition. He has a competent team with him, and that team has started the road to recovery. The alternative that you have is Ed Miliband and Ed Balls, people who were standing at the shoulder of the people who crashed the car in the first place. Do you really want to give the keys to the people who crashed the car in the first place, or do you want to go for stability and vote for David Cameron so that this country can continue to recover and hold its head up high on the international stage? Two minutes.